Hi guys, welcome back for another video. So today I am going to be showing you how to do this beautiful turban style using a raw silk scarf. So I have already actually done a uh, Instagram video for this. If you're new, I do weekly Instagram turban tutorials over on my channel Ice Cream One. Um, and I just thought I'd do a full length YouTube video for this as well because it is, it looks a lot more complicated than it is, but it's actually really easy um, when you know how. So this turb, this scarf, I was sent by um, a Nigerian company called Pink Fleur, F-L-E-U-R. I'll leave the name somewhere on the screen and also in the description comment, uh, description comments, in the description, so that if you do want to buy it, you can head over to their Instagram page and buy it. I'm not sure if they ship worldwide. Let me check. Um... It doesn't state it so if you visit their page this is them pink fleur um, and then just ask them they do really cool stuff clothes and everything as well so yeah and ask them if they do ship whoop, and ask them if they do ship worldwide so these are the scarves that pink fleur sent me um, and they come neatly packaged like this with the label and it tells you if it's square well at least these do I don't know if they all do um, so yeah they sent me this because I told them my favourite colour was mustard so they basically sent me like two different mustards this is more of a yellowy mustard and this is more of like gold so there's this colour, this colour, this green and this one is a square scarf and so so is this one, these two are square, this one's long and this one is like this and it's long and this is a nice red one but yeah the material is insane honestly look at it Try and I don't know if I can catch it, but it's really, really nice. So yeah, make sure to buy one because it is so versatile. You can make some, you can do some amazing kind of styles with it. So yeah. So without further ado, let's get into this video. If you're new, make sure to subscribe for more videos in the future and give this video a thumbs up and I'll catch you in my next video, guys. Okay guys, so you start off with your scarf. So like I said, I'm using Okay guys, so as I said, you start with your um, raw silk scarf, which this one is from Pink Fleur, like I've already mentioned, um, and it's folded in half. You need it, for, yeah, you need it folded in half. Okay, and can I just say, the material of this raw silk scarf is amazing. I don't know if you can tell from the camera. Let's see, I don't know. But yeah, it's amazing. And it's funny because I bought what I thought was uh, were raw silk scarves when I went to Nigeria. And they are a very different material. So I'm guessing that isn't actually raw silk, but um, that's what I was sold. So this is the actual one. It's so nice. So you just put it on your head, over your head like this, folded. Okay, so put it on your head, okay, and you want the two sides to be the same length, okay? Um, so just frame it around your face as you want it to be, so it can be forward. And I always get asked, like, if I've got a round face, how do I do scar- um, like, can you do tur turban tutorials for round faces and things like that? But honestly, all these tutorials will work with any face shape. It's just knowing where to, like, put it on your face. So if you've got a rounder face, you don't want to bring it too far forward, otherwise it'll make your face look rounder. Um, so take it back further. If you've got, like, a big forehead that you want to kind of cover up, then just bring it forward a bit more. Um, so yeah, I put it right about here. <clears throat> And when you finish, you can push it back further as well if you want to. So, you do, you just um, cross the two sides over. I'm sat down in a chair, so. Cross the two sides over like that. Okay. So, yeah, like, I figured out a setup where I can actually look into a mirror as well because this one definitely needs a mirror. Um, it's not hard at all, but it just needs a mirror so you can kind of see what you're doing. Okay, so you've crossed the two sides over. So just leave one side down, and then you need to start with, I'm starting with the right side. Um, so you can start with the right side if you want to follow along with me as well. And you literally just take this over the front of your head, starting from about an inch back I've started. You can start as far back as you want, but I wouldn't go any more further than kind of an inch back, to be honest. Okay, and then just bring it round, and then just tuck that little excess bit in this pocket here as neatly as you can like this okay 
and then don't worry that it's looking a bit of a mess right now now you take your other side and then you need to do pretty much the same thing but start a bit further back about here so and i've got a cold which is why i sound really weird and my nose is running so sorry if i keep sniffling <laughs> okay so you take this side and then you now then bring it over like this and tuck it in at the back here like so okay and i absolutely love this color it's so pretty okay so now all you need to do is create more folds as you kind of want it to look and you, i'm literally just using my fingers and my thumbs and my two thumbs to do this it's creating the folds taking them further and further back and this you know it doesn't necessarily have to be perfect i feel like the material is one where you know it doesn't have to be perfect but it'll still look good as long as you kind of do the majority of it right okay and then this excess bit here i mean if you want to leave it you can but i basically just bring it round to the back and just find a little pocket to tuck it into so i'll start putting it here first and then you just need to neaten this bit up as well so literally just like this just tuck things in it's a matter of kind of feeling and obviously you know as you go and look like get a mirror sorry my memory card ran out so i was just saying just tuck it in at the back and it you know feel it get a mirror look at the back i've not done so so i'm just gonna rely on what i'm feeling and then you just literally need to finish off by tidying everything up at the front so it so that looks kind of you know as you want it to look as neat as possible really so yeah just like this and that's literally it and obviously like i said get a mirror look at the back make sure it's you know exactly how you want it to look adjust anything it's all about adjusting with this one so just fold this over like this And that's literally it. Like I said, I've not looked in the mirrors in the like the back, so I don't know how the back's looking. Um, but I'll just turn around anyway and show you. Hopefully it's looking good. Feels good. Um, and then the other side, like I said, I'm sat on a chair. Um, and there you go. So I just um, adjusted things up, brought this out a bit more, fixed it all up, and yeah, how easy was that, honestly? Okay, so this time I'm going to use this, um, the square pink fleur, uh, I can't really think, raw silk scarf to achieve this style. It's really easy again and um, yeah, let's get straight into it. Okay guys, sorry, I've got a cold and this is a morning voice, so I just sound like a man, but never mind. So basically this is a square scarf folded in half, put it over your head, frame your face um, with the scarf and the two sides need to be equal size and uh, equal length. Okay, so just frame your face there and then just cross the two sides around at the back. Okay, just making sure it's as neat as possible. So you cross the two sides over and then you just need to kind of neatly like fold the two sides because you're going to basically bring it up over your head. So just, uh, I like to just lay things flat and neat so that when you do bring it up, it'll be as neat as possible. God, my voice sounds so bad. I've got such a cold. Okay, then you just bring it up to the front of your head, cross the two sides over exactly as I'm doing, and then just tuck one of the sides into the pockets, just like so. Okay, and you can pull that side bit up as well a bit to cover that bit that you've just tucked in if you want. Okay, and now you just open that other side, a bit like a flower, and then you just need to gather it all around to one side, <clears throat> just like that, and then just tuck the end in to that folded section and it'll just stay in place. How pretty is that? I really like it. 
I love the, the ruffle detailing, it looks really pretty. Ta-da! It's a that easy, guys. Uh, make sure to obviously look in the back and make sure you've tucked it in. Don't leave yours hanging like mine. I didn't look in the mirror at the back. But yeah, that's literally it. Nice and easy. Yes. Oh, 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 oh,